Amidst the smoke and rubble, Ukrainian emergency workers strive to rescue and recover the victims of Russia's latest attack. On Thursday, the Ukrainian village of Khroza was devastated by a Russian strike, which killed dozens of people, including a six-year-old child. According to the regional governor, a shop was hit as well as a cafe, where around 60 of the village's 330 inhabitants had gathered to pay their respects to a deceased villager. Minutes go by and the lifeless bodies pile up. Although Interior Minister Igor Klimenko said preliminary reports suggested the attack was caused by an Iskander missile, security services are still processing the scene. Prosecutors and investigators of the security services are working on the scene to analyze the debris and information about the victims and the type of weapons that were used for this attack. Criminal proceedings have been opened according to the criminal code of Ukraine. Moscow's latest strike is one of the deadliest since the start of the Russian invasion of Ukraine in February last year. An attack which drew vivid condemnation from the UN and by President Volodymyr Zelensky, who was in Spain for a European leaders' summit. Kyiv is categorical. This new Russian strike is proof that Ukraine needs to strengthen its anti-aircraft defense. Yet another appeal to its allies at a time when the Ukrainian cause is losing support in Western countries, particularly in the United States, an essential source of financial and military aid in resisting Russian forces.